You know what, if you are looking to serve up some traditional Mexican food from a local iconic restaurant, you are in luck this morning. We have Chef Teddy from Frank and Lupe's restaurant How's in it going? our kitchen. It's going to awesome. It. Hi. I am perfect. so excited about Weather's to have perfect, you. you know, December for summer. Hello, much. hello. First of all, first of all, you guys have been around you guys have been around in Mexico for thirty well, New years. Mexico New for Mexico thirty, 30 years, years in a small here? town of Socorro, south of Albuquerque. And then we've been here in Scottsdale for almost seventeen years now. Wow, that's yeah. a long time. That's Congratulations long time. Thanks, on thanks. that. So here basically what you're talking about is how that really if you wanna uh, well, serve up some tamales doing, and empanadas. Um, usually, you, gotta, you know, it's traditional for winter stuff. Every, you know, Christmas, yeah. every New Year's, everybody wants pork tamales, uh, green corn tamales. And then we're doing like a vegetarian empanadas that are ooh, nice too. Ooh, um, ooh. It's the same, the same ingredient that's in here with the empanadas or in the green corn tamales. So Excellent. they're both vegetarian. Excellent. But we also have the good old New Mexico red chili pork tamales. Oh my gosh. Those so yeah, there's a lot so of good, good stuff. Those know? look so good. Yeah, and you know? a lot of people lo love just serving them up for the holidays. And you're right. saying order now to get them in time, Order now, right? you know, especially right now, everybody's doing a lot of Christmas parties, mm -hmm, you know, mm -hmm. events, um, and just people that are like, oh, I need to grab something, you know, let's Good. go to Frank and Lupus, grab some chili. <laughs> we, you know, our winter salsa is a poblano salsa, it's a, like a cooler salsa. Why do you call um, it a winter salsa? Um, you know, it, it's it's a nice light salsa, it's perfect for dipping, so mm. a lot of people do appetizers and stuff, so that's perfect to put on empanadas, taquitos. And this is like finger food? That's finger food. So salsa, that's yeah. awesome. And you're going to show us how, yeah, how you make it. Yeah, I'll them? show you. Okay. Um, right now, I'm okay. going to do a, just a little, like a golf ball size uh, empanada here real quick. And what is this right here? Uh, this is maseca. It's like a, a flour and corn mixture. Okay. Um, what you do is, you know, not everybody has one of these presses at home. No. It's kind of... Oh, especially one like that. Yeah. Then you kind of just do it like that. You open it up. Oh, my goodness. How perfect is that? And then you put the corn in it. Corn and chilies. And then you fold it over to create your little empanada. And just kind of tap it on the sides. Can you put anything in an empanada? You can put anything. You know, uh, traditionally, a lot of people do sweet, sweet mm -hmm. empanadas, which mm -hmm. is more like a, um, uh, more like a raisins, like a minced meat. You mm -hmm. know, a lot of different. I like just good old. Uh, chicken, you know, basic, <laughs> basic stuff. Good old chicken. Yeah. I love it. I um, love it. But I love New Mexico green chili in it, um, especially the sauces when we put on top. We're going to let that fry a minute, and okay. then usually what we do is we'll put it, lay it out on a plate, and then we'll put the poblano salsa right on top of it. Oh. You know, and then we'll just um, garnish now, it with some cilantro. Is poblano sauce uh, spicier? Or? Uh, poblano is like a sweet spice to it. It's a nice, okay. it's a nice salsa to use. Um, if you don't want a lot of heat. Okay. You know, it has a lot of flavor. We mixed it in, that sauce we mixed it in with jalapenos, avocados, a little bit of lime juice, mm -hmm. um, a little bit of lettuce actually, and um, garlic and salt, and a little bit of uh, um, cumin. Oh, my stomach's growling. So. Okay, here's the thing about you guys is that you get your, your chilies from where? These yeah, are beautiful our, chilies. Um, we grow all our, our chili in Socorro, New Mexico, uh, off the Rio Grande there. It's really? a sandia chili, which is uh, mid middle of the state, southern New Mexico is Hatch Chili, do and northern New Mexico is Chimayo Chili. Chimayo Chili, does they, do they, are they hotter or spicy? Um, what, you know what, what? Uh, I think the, the Sandia Chili is a lot more flavor. Mm, mm, you these know, are beautiful. You know, we do have a, a lot of heat yeah. in it, but it's not, you know, it's not too bad. Um, I, I'm more about the flavor than the super heat. Yeah. And then, you know, and then you just got the, the, the corn. Oh my goodness. It's really hot me. right now. Yeah, it and is. Then, <laughs> and then just the, you know, dab on it, and it works Excellent. out perfect. Excellent. Well, well, Chef Teddy, you guys are amazing, and I, I, everybody raves about you, so you must be doing something right. Yeah, you know, knock on wood, we're one of the older restaurants in Old Town Scottsdale. Yeah. You know, we've been there for a long time. Um, we just try to keep, you know, service good. You know, that's usually the hardest, and then just trying to keep our, you know, our product the same all yeah. the time. So the service has got to be good, but the food's got to be better. Yeah, you know, we have a fun <laughs> patio on the back, you know, and it's, you know, it's like, it's still one of the older restaurants in Old Town Scottsdale, right yeah. in our district, or across from Eddie's house. Uh, um, just, north, you know, that area is a fun little restaurant area. You know. Well, and Frank and Lupe are your mom and dad, right? right? mom and dad. Oh, yeah, that's they, so they still cool. have the one in New Mexico. They still that's work awesome. the one. And then that's me awesome. That's Me and my brother Eddie run the one here in Scottsdale. So. All right. Well, here's the deal. you got to beat the rush. Order now for your holiday parties. Frank and Lupe's restaurant. They're in Old Town Scottsdale at 4121 North Marshall Way in Scottsdale. 480-990-9844. You can also custom order what you want inside your empanadas and your tamales. FrankandLupe's.com. Yeah, and our recipes are perfect. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>